you doing? Um, holding in there. I mean, that's what anybody tells you. Um, you, you were just talking to me. You, you walked for how long in the dark just, just um, to get here? About 12 miles to get to my dad's house. And you rode out the storm. Tell, tell the viewers about what you experienced, what it was like for you. Uh, terrifying, man. Um, I mean, I, I'm scared of heights already, and it just, my trailer was just bouncing up and down, and just, I uh, lost everything. It just well, wiped me out. And this is my first hurricane, so, you know, I'm scared. I, this is my home. What about your friends and family? Where, where are they at, man? You... Uh, I don't know. There's been no cell service since the thir Friday. Thursday, Friday. Um, haven't gotten a hold of anybody. Um, if uh, my mom and dad's watching, I'm okay. What are, what are their names, in case uh, they are? Betty and Brian. Um, where, where were they last? Uh, my mom's in Oklahoma. And my dad, I, there's no telling where my dad's at. Um, I'm here in Rockport, waiting on you. And I see the look in your eye here, looking, right? You know, and you're, I mean, you look shocked. Yeah, I mean, I just lost everything I worked for, uh, everything. Uh, the only thing I got is the clothes on my back, and hopefully my dad got out somewhere. And I don't know, maybe I should have left. Uh, maybe I should have left. Okay, Dad, I I'm going to jump on the bus. I'll be there. Are you okay? Yeah, uh, I'll jump I'll jump on one. Yeah, I'm in Rockport. Okay. Dad, I love you. Uh, <laughs> Okay, uh, all right, look, I'm gonna get off here. I'm gonna, uh, I'll be right there. Yes, yes, sir. Bye, Dad.